Yeah, keep your hair on. I'm coming. Hey. Hey. Have you been telling people that I meant to race? What? He just hit on me. Apparently your grandmother put him up to it. Gran? Oh, I never told her specifically. Oh, but you've been telling people. Me and Chris might have been talking and Gran might have heard us. Saying what? I thought there was a... Oh, what would you call it? Like a vibe between you. I have a boyfriend! I know, and I'm all for you guys. I'm the one that told you not to give up on Scotty, remember? Yeah, because you thought that I was interested in your flatmate. Yeah, well, I just didn't want you to go there. On account that he still hung up on Vanessa. Oh, geez, aren't you really nice just looking out for everyone's relationships? Guess I'm not that good at picking up on vibes. No, no, you're not. I'm really sorry, Georgia. Look, is there anything that I can do to make it up to you? Yes, actually, you can just keep your big... You out of my life, OK? No, I can't read this. This is a private email. Well, it's her fault for leaving it behind in her desk. Yes, all right, I know it's wrong, but this isn't about Summer. This is about me and Andrew. So I did pick up on something this morning. You know, last week, when all that stuff was happening with Paul, Andrew's way of making it up to me was to take me to a really nice hotel. Uh, well, I've got to say, I thought they would score points with you. It did. But somewhere along the track, I realised that I want more. And this email shows me why I'm not getting it. Andrew had this really deep and meaningful relationship with Summer. With us, I, I feel like the physical stuff is more important. OK. What if he doesn't see me as a long-term thing? Well, look, if you want more from Andrew, you need to talk to him. Be honest. Hey, you might even be surprised. Oh. Rough morning? Yeah, thanks to your housemates. Oh, and for the record, I don't find Reese even the slightest bit attractive. Got it. Why did you have to open your trap? I didn't know that Reese was going to ask Georgia out. I just said it to boost his ego. Well, he did. And now she's really upset. Oh, an attractive man asks her out and she says no. <laughs> not exactly the end of the world, is it? That's not the point. And she doesn't even like Reese. Well, then why did you say she did? She told Chris that she was having problems with Scotty. She put off going home to see him. OK, but what's that got to do with Reese? She likes chatting to him. I thought there was a thing. A thing. A thing. And that was your smoking gun. Fine. I stuffed up, but you didn't have to spread it around as well. Well, you seem to be spending a lot of time on this girl's love life. I don't want her to get hurt. Nothing more than that? Like what? A man spends all his time thinking about a woman. You tell me. What, me and Georgia? Mm. No. Are you sure? I don't want you wasting your time on a taken lady. We're just mates. Well, that's how it starts, you know. Kyle Eugene Canning, you be careful. Nothing is getting started. I don't even like her like that. Hey. Oh. How is he? It's good. It's fine. You didn't have to come back. Oh, we didn't um, get to finish our chat this morning. There's nothing more to say. Well, no, there is. There is. Because if you get back together with Reese, I um, I, I might regret it. <laughs> it's over with Reese. I made sure he got the message today. Oh. Well, now why, why today? I mean, the timing. Does it have anything to do with Lucas? No. Lucas is getting on with his life, and I'm happy for him. How do you feel about Lucas? I'm sorry to put you on the spot, but it's important. Uh, Luke, is Patrick's father. Yeah, well, look, that's not what I asked. Uh, I've, look, I've tried to not get involved to a certain extent, and I, look, I've been, I've been debating whether or not to say something. I just, I don't want Lucas to get hurt. Neither do yeah, I. But you need to know that the only reason that he's backing away is because he thinks you want him to. <sighs> he's in love with you, Vanessa. He always has been. Well, why can't he just tell me? Because he's scared that you reject him. Look, I care about you both, and I know Lucas. I know what he's like when he shuts down. And if there is any chance, if there's any chance that you feel the same way about him, you need to let him know before it's too late. Hey, 
Hey. Hey, feet all right? Yeah, sure did. Good. Are you in love with me? What? Are you? Lucas, I need to know. Yes. Why didn't you ever say anything? Because I figured you didn't feel the same way. You're with Reese. You said yes to his proposal. How do you feel about me? What's that? Uh -huh. George, what's going on? Oh, his oxygen levels are dropping. What? What? He's not breathing? Just going to check. He, he was just fine just now. What's going on? Just give me a sec, guys. Georgia. I'm oh, sorry, it's, it's serious. Can we get the team in now? Monday on Neighbours. Hey, Vanessa, the last thing they need is us in there getting in the way, Everybody OK? Everyone said he was fine. Uh, we're moving him into OR4. They're ready for him now. What, he needs surgery? There is an opportunity for you to stay on if you play your cards right. Keep it professional. I saw someone today at Lasseter's. Thought I'd seen her somewhere, then I figured it out. He's in here. The Ramsey Street reunion video. Is there something I should know? I made some decisions, Toad. Missed an episode? Watch full episodes and catch up on all the latest at neighbours.com.au.